How to set up your controller for Baptiste and Overwatch 2. Hey! So if you haven't seen my previous video on how to set up your pro controller for other heroes like Lucio or Mercy, I highly recommend you check that out first. With that in mind, I'll be showing you various different setups on custom remapping your pro or not pro controller based on your playstyle and preferred hero. This time with X Talon Operative and Redemption Seeker, Baptiste. I'm at fighting condition. When it comes to a high damage dealing support, Baptiste is one hero you can consistently rely on. If you notice that the damage heroes on your team aren't performing as ideally as you were expecting, Baptiste can provide the necessary damage and even last hits, as well as dishing out healing bursts to keep his teammates alive. But as some of you may know, an inefficient Baptiste is one whose survivability is severely hampered when tethered to the ground. So customizing your settings as well as your controller layout will naturally help you achieve more fluid control. First up, we have the standard layout. You may end up deciding to just keep everything in default settings, so I'll include this layout among the choices. But sticking to default tends to favor those who like to switch heroes more often than not. But since Baptiste is one hero who's highly aim dependent when it comes to dealing damage and healing friendlies, then you may want to adjust your aim sensitivity settings first. So open the menu and select options. Press R3 and select Baptiste. Now that you have Baptiste on screen, take advance and copy the sensitivity and aim settings on screen. While it's clearly up to your own preference, this is what I personally use when playing as Baptiste. But as for the Pro Controller, like the DualSense Edge, you can set the X button to the left back button, or LB, and then the circle button to the right back button, or RB. Feel free to swap these two if you wish. For a non-Pro Controller, we have the Exo Boots layout. Have you ever experienced those situations where you just can't seem to pin down the enemy Baptiste whenever he bounces around so much? That's what you get with this layout. Making full use of Baptiste's exo boots, while well, keeping your thumbs in the thumbsticks most of the time, is a great way to make sure you stay alive and more importantly, stay effective. On the controls panel for Baptiste, scroll down to the movement section and remap jump to L2, and then remap toggle crouch to R3. Then in the weapons and abilities section, remap ability 1 or Regenerative Burst to the X button, Ability 2 or Immortality Field to the L1 button, Interact to the left D-pad, Secondary Fire or Biotic Grenades to the R1 button, and then Quick Melee to the Circle button. By default, I also remap the Ping in World function on the Communications tab to the L3 button, but you may also opt to just remap Quick Melee to the L3 button instead. That is if you prioritize Quick Melee more than the ping system. As for the Pro Controller, you can map the left back button for Regenerative Burst and the right back button for the Ultimate Amplification Matrix. This will allow you to be almost completely independent of the face buttons. The communicator layout is a lot like the previous layout, but with the back buttons repurposed for communication instead. If you're not already using L3 button for ping and world, I recommend remapping this important communication function to one of your back buttons instead. On the communications tab, scroll down to ping and world and bind it to the right D-pad. Now on your pro controller, remap the down D-pad to the left back button, and then the right D-pad to the right back button. This ensures that you'll be able to communicate effectively without having to stop in place just to press the D-pad. And then by leveraging your exo boots, you can get an elevated view of the battlefield to tag enemies that your teammates won't otherwise see. There are so many ways to customize your button layouts for the pro controller of your choice, but these are the three I found most useful when playing Baptiste. If you have your own preferred button layout, feel free to share it in the comments section down below. And if you want to see more of my custom layouts for other Overwatch 2 heroes, consider subscribing to my channel for future updates. GG everyone. Peace.